The legacy of Bhuj is displayed from its different places such as Prague Mahal, Aina Mahal, Ranjit Villa etc. that houses a collection of exquisite artifacts. The Kutch Museum formerly known as Ferguson Museum was initially established a school of arts established by Maharao Kingarji III in 1877. The present structure of the museum was built in 1884 to exhibit the wedding gifts of Maharao Kingarji III. The Maharao's museum was later opened to the public post-independence. The museum depicts Italian Gothic style and is located opposite Hamirsa Lake in Bhuj, Kutch. The location serves as an important role in history. The museum has the largest existing collection of Kshatrapa inscriptions, an interesting collection of coins including the Koris, Kutch's local currency till 1948. The museum has almost 11 sections which broadly display Indus seals, stone tablets, ancient artifacts, sculpture, precious metalworks, textile shipping sections, folk arts, crafts, embroidery and arms. The Rawat is a carved wooden snow white Indian elephant with seven tusks is one of the chief attractions at the museum after which a postal stamp was published in 1978. The art and craft of Kutch is an intangible part of culture which needs to be brought forward to the visitors via its tangible items which is nothing but the museum's art collection. The Secretariat of the Ministry of Sports, Youth and Cultural Activities and the Directorate of Archaeology and Museums, Government of Gujarat has undertaken the revitalization of the museum. The tender focuses on the aspects of maintenance, promotional activities and curatorial practices by outsourcing work to professional field experts. The affluence of the culture of Kutch is widespread and attracts many visitors especially during the Ranotsav. However, the popularity of the museum is not far-reached and requires promotion. The role played by social media, museums, user-friendly website promotion and tie-ups with various travel bloggers is at the top tier for influencing people. The other adverts include large holdings at public places, publications in magazines, newspapers, academic curriculums and brochures catering to every age group and class of people. The museum souvenir act as passive interactive promotion where people themselves create publicity via mouth or souvenirs. Museum specific facilities such as audio guides, guided tours, workshops, seminars, heritage walks, art exhibitions and tactile approaches can enhance the visitor experiences. Also, the basic facilities such as cafes, toilets and parking ease the convenience of visitors. An integrated teamwork is the key to maintenance of the museum. The staff will be trained periodically to handle collection and learn newer techniques as per INTAC and British Conservation Lab and Maintenance Manuals. The locals can be made stakeholders by forming Friends of Museum, employing locals and volunteer groups as learned from Dr. Bhav Daji Lad Museum and Prince of Wales Museum Mumbai case study. The archives of the museum can be digitized to provide library along with research labs to conduct the conservation researches as an additional means of the earnings for the museums besides tickets and souvenir sales. The necessary emergency facilities will include firefighting equipments, first aid kits and CCTVs to safeguard the collection. However, human life is above all and hence the staff will be trained for mock drills to evacuate during the emergency situations and will be attached to the hospital for medical emergencies. We at Savani Heritage Conservation Private Limited have been proudly associated with the various museum maintenance works in the past such as Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj Vastu Sangrale Mumbai since 2007, Prague Mahal Bhuj, Surat Castle Surat, Sarkarwada Nasik, Jaikar Bungalow Pune, Balad Bandar Gate Mumbai and Judiciary Museum of Bombay High Court which was inaugurated by the Honorable Prime Minister of India. We are thankful to the Ministry of Sports, Youth and Cultural Activities for giving us a chance to present our views on City Museum Bhuj. To conclude, a consolidated approach should be adopted to consider every aspect for a smoother functioning of a museum and its maintenance. The promotion and branding of the museum will definitely help to attract a number of visitors and glorify the Kutch Museum on world map. Thank you.